Okay, so this is a quick 3D pen hack. I have one of these Pixar lamps, uh, for lack of a better term. I don't know what they're called, desk lamp. And it, it works fine, it just doesn't have the little base with the clamp, the little L-shaped thing that comes down to clamp it onto your table. And, uh, but I have a 3D pen uh, and I have this clamp. And so I'm just gonna make something uh, to make it work. All right, so these are my materials. I have the lamp. Uh, I have my clamp. I'm going to use a green filament just because the work surface here is black. And if I use my normal black filament, you wouldn't be able to see it on video. And then this tube I found around my shop, it fits on to this thing pretty well. Pretty snug. So I'm going to cut that down uh, and attach it to that clamp using the 3D pen. Pushing the black filament I had in there before. Now it's coming out green. Now I'm hitting this with glue uh, because the 3D filament will stick to the glue really well. And that'll help it get a tighter bond rather than um, cooling down and slipping off of the tubing when I put it down. This video is sped up about 20 times, uh, but the entire process took about 20 minutes. Um, it's a really satisfying process for me. It's you're just, you know, oozing plastic out of the uh, the tip of the 3D pen, coating it. I, I made up the uh, the idea for these ribs uh, to hold the thing a little more upright and be a little more efficient with the material usage. I kind of did that on the fly and then just kind of, you know, thought through what I needed as I was doing it. And, um, you know, it's ugly, but it doesn't matter. All it has to do is hold this tube. Take it off the blue tape. I now have a very usable mount for this lamp. Totally sturdy, enough to do the job. Uh, could I have designed something and then 3D printed it? Uh, you know, it would be hard to use this clamp and to measure this clamp perfectly and make something to interface with that rather than just like printing directly onto it. That's the cool thing about 3D pens. I am going to come back and fill this in in the bottom to give it more strength across this way. Uh, but other than that, this took me 20 minutes and I basically have the light that I need to use today. Don't have time to 3D print something. I wanna use this lamp today and I was able to make a solution that I can use today using the 3D pen.